Alright, so today we're going to be talking about the derivative of cotangent of x. All you need to know are some sine and cosine properties and how to use the quotient rule. So, we can write this as the derivative of cotangent of x is the same thing as the derivative of cosine of x over sine of x. Now, the reason I know this is because I know that tangent of x is the equivalent of sine of x over cosine of x. And because we know that cotangent of x is the same thing as 1 over tangent of x, we can just flip the sine and the cosine to get this. Okay? And then we use the uh, quotient rule to derive this. So we take the derivative of the numerator, so that would be negative sine of x, multiply it by the denominator, denominator, we get sine of x, subtract the derivative of the denominator, so that's cosine of x, and multiply that by the numerator, so that's cosine of x. All of this all over the denominator squared, so sine of x squared. Now we can multiply the numerator. Uh, we get negative sine squared x minus cosine squared x all over sine squared x. Now here we're going to do something like what we did in the tangent of x uh, derivative video, but we have to factor out a negative first because what we're trying to accomplish is so that the numerator equals sine squared x plus cosine squared x. So we can do that by just whoop, factor out a negative one and we get sine squared x plus cosine squared x all over sine squared x, right? And now, uh, we know that sine squared x plus cosine squared x is equiv equivalent to 1, just one of those sine and cosine properties. So we can write this as negative 1 times 1, so just negative 1, over sine squared x. And now, we know that uh, if we take 1 over sine of x, that's the same thing as cosecant of x, right? So if we take 1 over sine squared x, that should be cosine squared x, right? And then since we have this negative, we put this negative here. And that is the derivative of cotangent of x. It's that simple. Ooh, it's the end screen. Click on one of these links to be directed to that playlist. And don't forget to subscribe!